Hello and welcome to Economics with Eli. Today I want to run you through marginal utility and what it means. Okay, imagine this is a glass of water and you are on a mission in the desert. Okay, so we're discussing marginal utility. Now you're walking in the desert, you're walking in the desert, you're walking in the desert, you're extremely thirsty. How much are you willing to pay for that glass of water? Now let's say you're willing to pay 10 rand. But now instead of making it around um, a rand, I'm going to make it 10 points or utilities. Utilities. Think of utilities as points. So we're playing a video game. For that glass of water, you're willing to sacrifice 10 points. Okay. But now you go past the tree and you see there's another glass of water. Now you're still thirsty. You're still willing to give away points, but you're not necessarily willing to give away 10 points. Let's say you're willing to give 9 points. Okay. You walk a little bit further in the desert and there's another glass of water. How much are you willing to give for that glass of water? That might be eight. And so you're willing to pay less and less and less and less and less. You're willing to sacrifice points downwards until you come to a point where you are really not thirsty anymore. And you don't actually want more water. You just want to go lie down there and have a lack of snooze. And at that point, it's a zero. After that, if somebody still makes you drink a glass of water, it might be negative. It might actually make you feel nauseous, like you don't want to drink any more water. Okay, now I bet you're asking, why am I drawing a desert when you're trying to figure out marginal utility? I know we are busy with economics. I'm just trying to make it a little bit more fun. So there we go. That is what marginal utility is. It's the amount of points or utilities you are willing to give away extra for the next thing. So if you have a table, and here you have one, two, three, four, let's call this units or products, product, okay? And this one is marginal utility. Now the first glass of water, you are willing to give away 10 points or 10 utilities for. The next one, maybe even 11 because you were that thirsty, and then it starts dropping. Then it'll drop. It'll go to nine, and then maybe to six until it goes into the minus. Marginal utility, it's the, X, it's the point you're willing to pay. But then they also give you the total utility. Total, T for total utility. Now, one was just 10. But your total utilities here was 21. The total utilities here was 30. So what I'm doing is I'm adding it up. So 10, there you've spent 21 points. There you've spent 30 points. Here you've spent 36 points. Okay, so this is total utility. Then you also have average. Average utility. 10 divided by 1 is still 10. The second one, you go to your total utilities, which was 21. So how much did each round of points, if it is an average, so it's 21 divided by 2, which gives you 10.5. 30 divided by 3 gives you 10, 36 divided by 4 gives you 9. So you can see that your average is going down and your marginal utility is going down. And this has to do with a very important law, the law of diminishing, diminishing, the law of diminishing utility. Diminishing marginal utility. There we go. Great. It's short and sweet today, but that is what marginal utility is.